Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey from interest.co.nz and welcome to a special edition of the Interest Rate Outlook, where we have news that economists from the major banks have brought forward their forecasts for a cut in the official cash rate. ASB, BNZ, ANZ National and Westpac all now say the first cut in the official cash rate in nearly five years is likely to happen in September. Previously, most of them had said it wasn't due until December. This is all because of very weak jobs data yesterday. Westpac described it as shockingly weak. BNZ said it was as horrible as it looked, and ASB described the jobs data as a shock plunge. Now, it's very unusual for economists to use words like shock, horrible, and plunge, uh, particularly because they are reluctant to um, overuse words like shock and plunge. They have a thesaurus marked out that says, don't use this words and these words unless you really have to. Now, all are saying the economy is weakening much faster than everyone, that's including the Reserve Bank, had previously expected. But will the Reserve Bank governor think the same way as the economists? How worried is he about inflation? Well, actually, I think he's very worried. Just the day before yesterday, at a press conference to release the financial stability report, he was asked about the economic situation. And the first thing he said was that he believed that there had been some sort of decoupling between the United States and Asia in particular. Asian growth is very fast right now and inflation is a real worry there. It's feeding through into the whole Asian economy and into Australia as well, because Australia is producing a lot of the raw materials needed for Asia's boom and prices, particularly export prices, are rising quite fast. He also has a track record where inflation has been higher than the government's target band for quite some time. And in fact, seven of the last 12 quarters, inflation has been above the top of the one to 3% target band. He, and the other question is, what does he think about economic growth? He has talked about a slowdown, but you've got to remember, unemployment is still 3.6%. That's historically very low. The labour market is still as tight as a drum. And we saw some stats out from Stats New Zealand a couple of days ago showing that over the long term, the labour force is, the growth in the labour force is slowing. We're seeing a slowdown in migration from the rest of the world and an increase in immigration by New Zealanders to Australia in particular. So overall, the labour market is very tight. We're seeing wages inflation coming through and inflation from the rest of the world. So there isn't still much room for Governor Bollard to ease rates. My bet is that we still won't see a rate cut until December. I'm Bernard Hickey for interest.co.nz and that was a special edition of the Interest Rates Outlook.